So I have a feeling that this is uh, probably my keychain that I ordered. It's, uh, it says design in USA and made in China. Alright, so let's go ahead and get it open. I can do this without cutting my finger. And I'm already trashing the box. Look. So there is the keychain. And um, I, you know, I've been trying to figure out if I'm going to use this actually as a keychain or um, to hook stuff on my backpack, which is uh, really what I wanted to do. But uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, there are two in here. This actually might work better on my backpack. Um, so, you've got the ability to uh, hook this on there, like so. And this actually, it's got some kind of spring in it. I don't know if you can see that spring in there. Let's see if we can get closer. That would prove, yeah, there's a pretty strong spring in there. And uh, you can feel some force to it. Um, wow, that's powerful. Uh, let's see, it looks like a plastic plastic housing here, uh, brownish in color. And then on this side, you've got uh, the place where you're going to put your keys on there. So I would say you can rest assured that's going to stay on whatever whatever you put it on. Um, take a lot of force to pop that open. I've never actually seen a keychain like this. Um, so pretty good. I had some keys to put on there, but I will um, figure out what to do with this. So this, this I've got to say, is really nice. All right, so this one is uh, maybe it's a little more traditional, I would say. Um, and this one may be perfect for the backpack. Not necessary to put my house keys on, but other things on there. So um, this also, wow, another super strong spring you know I thought I was just getting something that would kind of just easily latch on but that thing's uh, really actually pretty strong you hear that click that's in there good so this one is uh, looks like it's chromed I'm not sure what if it's actually steel it feels pretty light to be steel might be uh, maybe it's aluminum that's chromed or something um, but it looks it looks pretty nice, folks. Uh, very happy with this. I don't know if I need the dual um, uh, loops on here. I think one loop's probably enough, but pretty good. I'll give I got one of these for my son and one for me.